hey, hey. all right, everybody. Now, I happen to be on Twitter again. I'm either on Twitter or YouTube seeing something. And this time, it was about the ZEV mandate in the UK. So that's the Zero Emissions Vehicle Mandate. Um, and I think, let me just look on the tablet a minute and I'll tell you who actually uh, posted it. If this will come up on my tablet. Come on, tablet's a bit slow. But, um, so I was looking at Twitter and I think it was Colin Walker and he said that MPs have just voted and passed the ZEV mandate into law. So it's passed now, it's done and dusted. It is going to come into law. And it was 381 eyes to 37 no's. <laughs> and uh, it looks like a lot of people didn't turn up to vote on it. So there we go. Um, and that comes into force on the 1st of January 2024. So that's less than four weeks away. So next year, what it means is that next year now, the car manufacturers have got to sell 22% of their uh, cars have got to be zero emission vehicles. Um, so that's that means that that uh, all the cars they sell in 2024, 22% of them must be zero emission vehicles. And if they don't sell them, there's a fine. So I think I have got some more information here. Let's have a look if I can find it. Uh, so it starts on the 1st of January 2024. And that's 22% of all cars sold per manufacturer. And then by 2026, that number rises to 33%. And then by 2028, that number rises to 52%. And then by 2030, that number will rise to 80%. So it's like nearly all your cars sold in 2030 has got to be 80% zero emissions vehicle. Now, if you go back a month or two ago, I can't remember when, but Rishi Sunak sort of pushed the, the zero emission vehicles to 2035. But he didn't really, did he? <laughs> because 80% um, by 2030, I mean, that's quite a lot, isn't it? Now, they can get away with it. They can pay a fine. Um, if they don't reach the the targets each year, they can pay a fine or they can get credits off other car companies. Now, it's not just cars. It's also vans. And vans start at 10%. So that's going to be a slower... It's starting at a lower um, percentage for vans. So it's 10% starting in 2024 for zero emission vehicles. This is in the UK, mine, right? I've got, got to stress it's in the UK. And the fines are going to be this, um, £15,000 for every car that's sold under the 22%. That's what it starts off at, at. And it'll be, I think, let me just check. And it's £18,000 per van. So that's if they fall short of their quota. Now they can get, I think they can get credits from other car companies. So if a car company sells 30% zero emission vehicles, they can nick some credits off them. If they don't, they've got to pay fines. Um, so if they, if they didn't sell any um, electric vehicles, well, not just electric vehicles, just it means zero emissions vehicles. So it could be hydrogen as well, or if they come up with something new in the next couple of, couple of weeks. <laughs> but um, so they've got to pay fines if they don't reach the 22%. Now, Tesla, for instance, is 100% uh, zero emission vehicles. So they can get credits. Tesla will get credits and they can give them to uh, the car companies or the car companies can buy them off them. I think something like that. That's how it works anyway. So is that going to be enough to push electric vehicles to be sold faster? Because um, I think personally it's going to be hard for car manufacturers, not all car manufacturers, but some. I think MG might be all right and Tesla is obviously going to be okay. Um, but I think other car manufacturers might struggle to get to hit that 22%. So you might see some sort of hard-hitting sales tactics trying to get to the 22%. I'm not quite sure because I'll do another video after this one about the decline in electric vehicles uh, sales. So if you stick around, well, don't stick around. Just go and have a cup of tea. Do whatever you want. Come back whenever you want. <laughs> But I am going to make another video after this one about the decline in electric vehicle sales and why I think that is. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, give it a like, subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one. Woohoo!